So the other day I talked about hot wallets and cold wallets, what the difference is between them when you would use one over another, etc. However, I want to talk a little bit more about wallets in general. So your crypto lives on the blockchain. It does not live on the wallet. So when we think about a physical wallet, we think about money in the wallet and you carry that money around, you pull the money out of your wallet and you do whatever it is that you're going to do with your money. Now, that's not the way that it works in crypto. So your secret phrase that you get whenever you set up a wallet acts like a key. And that key is going to open up a door. And that door is called a wallet. Your crypto exists on the blockchain. So once you open up that door, you have access to the room which holds your crypto, that room being the blockchain. So how does this play out in practicality? If I have a hot wallet and I have a Uniswap wallet and I just want to switch to Coinbase wallet just because I like the interface, whatever, doesn't matter my reasoning, I just want to use the Coinbase wallet. But rather than sending every single crypto asset over to Coinbase wallet and incurring a fee for every transaction, you can just use your key, your secret phrase, to open up that same door, a new door to the same room and access your crypto. So how this works for a cold wallet is if someone were to take my device or if I was going to lose my physical cold wallet, they don't necessarily have my crypto, right? Acted The added security that comes with a cold wallet is that they would have to steal two things. And the two things that they would have to steal is my actual physical device and it's my secret phrase, right? They haven't stolen my key. They just stole the access to my key. So... If I was going to need access to my cold wallet again and I lost my physical hardware device, I can order another one from the company because I still have my key. All I need is access to my key using another physical device because my crypto lives on the blockchain.